There is one day to go. I'm very excited. Uh, today I wanted to talk about Google. Um, but before I get into that, you might be thinking that this is going to be a rant about um, how like technology is evil and we should all go back and live in our caves and stuff. But no, I'm not a hippie like that. <laughs> um, I actually really like technology. Um, I love like how all the latest developments. I, I like following all the latest developments and just how like unpredictable they are. How like no one would have predicted drones or virtual reality or um, all this crazy stuff that's coming out, 3D printing, um, and it's all this stuff is just around the corner. Like you don't know what's coming next, and it's uh, it really excites me. Um, so yeah, I love technology. Um, and this isn't a rant about Google. Google's actually one of my favourite companies, and I'd like to tell you why. Um, it's partly because, like, just the numbers, just the statistics are quite staggering. Uh, like, every minute of every day, I believe the number is 48 hours worth of videos are uploaded to YouTube. Hundreds of websites are being created. Um, I'll have to uh, check that in the blog, but I'm pretty sure that's the case. And it's probably actually more since that statistic was published. Um, and Google has to do all sorts of crazy stuff with all this terabytes of data coming in. It's got to index all these websites so that they can be searched. It's got to do all crazy kind of crazy processing um, and stuff I don't even know about. Uh, yeah, uh, I'm sure I'll be learning about as part of my course. But um, because of that, Google is one of the biggest users easily, one of the biggest users of, day of um, energy in the world today. Uh, they use more energy than entire countries. Uh, which brings me to the reason why I like Google so much, which is since 2007, they have been completely carbon neutral. And I think that's just staggering. That's just incredible. And this year, 2017, they're going to be um, running off of 100%. They're going to reach 100% renewable energy. Um, it's just mind-boggling. Like, how they're one of the biggest users, if not the biggest users of, of energy in the world today. Um, yeah, because since 2007, they've been partially running off renewable energy, but then they, they offset the rest um, through like planting trees and other ways that um, reduce the amount of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere that balances out the amount that they give off. That's the whole idea of offsetting. Um, but now they're going to um, be running off 100% renewable energy, uh, which is amazing. Um, and one day I'd like to do the same. One day I want to be com completely carbon neutral. And this challenge has made me realise that there's a lot of work to do. Uh, I need to um, sort out the bike and um, maybe move to a hotter country so I can actually use the solar panel properly. Because um, on good days I can get like a quarter to a third of my phone charged, but um, most days it's not not a lot, maybe a few percent. Uh, so I need to really work on this. Um, but I think it'll be a good um, thing to keep going as a side project. So I'll definitely um, I'll like post any like breakthroughs I have on the channel. I'll keep the blog updated with any like regular stuff that I'm doing on it. Um, but yeah, Google gives me hope for the future. If Google can do it right, then I think anybody can. Um, so yeah, that's everything for today. I'm very excited for tomorrow. I'll uh, probably do one last update just to uh, let you know how I'm getting on, but it's going to be good. All right, see you.